losses and two draws. He was the 32nd Isuzu Cup Tournament Champion. And he took the place of Shalam Dam TBM Jim. There you can see the tail of the tape for this matchup. Currently Team South in fifth place. They need the points. So it's up to uh, Yorpayak to try and deliver and it's gonna be a tough ask against someone as talented as the Isuzu Cup winner that is Suksawai. The referee in charge for this one is referee Arun Gupatachad. Just a ringside to one in Gobon Sanong, Om Im and Pukit Bramprayun. A lot of replacements for the East. Indeed, throughout the entire tournament, of course, Team East currently in third position. It's the top four teams who go through to the next round. So right now, the South team, Yon Payak's team, will be going out. I mean, it is expected in such a grueling tournament like this. Oh, absolutely. You can't expect everyone to stay 100% at yeah, all times. for sure. And let's not forget what happened to Suksawat last time. That's true, and Yon Payak obviously coming off a knockout victory as well, so a lot to prove here, perhaps, for Suksawat. And let's not forget, I mean, Suksawat, he was part of the big Thai fight team at one point. Yeah. He thought he proved himself enough already, winning the Isusa Cup tournament. Oh, left hand there from Suksawat. Yeah, very well placed there from Suksawat. So Team East currently on 11 points, Team South, Yodpayak's team on 9. So if Yodpayak gets the victory here tonight by a knockout, indeed he will actually leapfrog Team East. Can definitely happen. Suksawat, as we know, he likes to fight on the back foot. He's doing that right now. Big oh, elbow there from Suksawat. Oh, massive elbow, he's not listening to the referee. The referee was trying to separate them two. He went straight after your player. I think the referee's just trying to give a count. Is that what it was? That's probably what it was, yes. I thought the fact that he was uh, between the ropes, meant the referee was trying to stop Suksawat from advancing, but there you have it. Nevertheless. Nevertheless, we continue. Suksawat very much in the driver's seat at the moment. Oh, a solid left kick to the body. Your player felt all of that one. Another elbow attempt by Suksawat, and that's what took his opponent down the first time. I mean, it is something that Suksawat has been trying to change about his style. He's been trying to get more knockdowns, trying to fight more aggressively. Right hand there. And that clip the forehead of uh, Suksawat. Firing those left kicks, as we know he would do. That's a good elbow strike there, I believe, from Yon Koyak. Yeah, those elbow counters from Suksawat, they're so dangerous. Could come from oh! any angle. Left hook from hell! I think Suksawat's down, is he? No, he's not. <laughs> I was getting a bit too excited there. Well, if Yon Koyak got up quicker, he might have been down. Oh, big left hand again, and I think Suksawat walked straight into it. He's holding on. For dear life at the moment. Yeah, Suksawat's in trouble. Yon Koyak trying to fire in more hand strikes here. Suksawat trying to fire in a counter elbow. Suksawat now all over the place. Good elbow counter, and that ends the first round. Fascinating, entertaining. Stay with us. What a round of action we just witnessed. There was that left elbow from Suksawat, and you can see he went in for the kill as the referee did try to stop it too. Like you said, Kevin. He did. Count. There it is again. He'll be through the ropes and still getting cracked with right elbows to the side of the head. I mean, I tell you what, Yon Payak did very well to get back up from that. And then Yon Payak, of course, needing to find some. There was that left hook. Didn't technically floor Suksawat, but he definitely took away his equilibrium. And from there on out, Yopayak went in for the kill. He was covering up, but he was eating a lot of strikes. Somehow managed to survive that onslaught. That right hand, that devastating right hand from Yopayak. <laughs> I guess. 
Well, it sets up. Well, on the I box, think. but almost got the job done. Let's see what happens here in round number two. Yep, 10 9 round for Suxawat. Suxawat again on the back foot, perhaps looking for a counter elbow. Good low kick from Yotpaya. Another right hand there from Yotpaya. Again, getting caught with the hands. Suxawat now, looking like he's in a lot of trouble. Well, yeah, like I said, when the bell rung, he was actually staggering from side to side. Another strong hand here from Yopayak. Yopayak seems to be enjoying himself in there. He really does. Yeah, he really does. Oh, Good left that hand. hand. That was timed to perfection by Suxawak. Oh, that was excellent from Suxawak. He's a very good counter fighter, but I don't think he should think about it. It's, um, trading blows with his opponent. There's, there's no way he'll get the job done there. Another kick from Yonpia connecting. Good low kick there from Yonpia. Yonpia now looking like he's in the driver's seat. Strong left kicks. The textbook left kicks. Oh! That's it. That's it. Oh! I was talking about a left hook from the depths of hell in round number one. Well, it's been executed right here. In fact, it was an attempted assassination. It was an, at an assassination by Jan Payak. Wow, about that. That was excellent. The left hook as Suxawai bounced off the ropes, connected perfectly, knocking out Suxawai. Above the east. Let's have a look at it once again. Coming off the ropes and a boom! You do not get up from that. You can see what Suxo was going for. He's going for the counter elbow, but nevertheless, that left hand though from Yot Payak was a little bit better. That much more accurate. Oh! Yot well Payak, you know what? He knew what was coming. He knew exactly what Suxo was intending when he went back against those ropes. And he counted it with that beautifully timed left hook. Two, knock. Lepon Kanta Sinikap, the winner by technical knockout white corner, Yod Payak from Team Park. Bye! Lepon Chana Krang Nikap, Tamay Team Park, Bye! บวกไปอีก 3 คะแนน